If you haven't noticed, YouTube has changed their algorithm and a lot of you guys are missing out on all our new episodes. Make sure and subscribe if you haven't already and turn on the notifications bell so you don't miss any of our episodes. Do us a huge favor and let's see if we can get today's episode to 30,000 likes. Today we're putting a boyfriend to the test and we're using my good friend Catherine and Sarah and they are the Swallow Twins. Yes. Real last name. So. They've earned it. <laughs> Setting up a date on Tinder isn't that innocent. Find out whether your partner crosses the line while they're in a relationship with you and stop wasting your time. Use the Light app and protect yourself at all times. She is putting her fiance to the test. Deborah has a very touching story. She reached out to me on Instagram. About three years ago, found out I had breast cancer. And so I went through all the treatments, the chemo radiation, and currently I'm in remission. And yeah, thanks. Uh, my boyfriend at the time, he was all like, I just was hearing rumors that it was possible that he was out there cheating on me or like was seeing other women talking to a lot of, and you know, when I confronted him about possibly like, hey, what are you doing while I'm going through all this? He decided, okay, I'm gonna propose. So he proposed. We got engaged. Said, you said yes. Yeah. So one time he left his maps open, he had gone somewhere. And so I traced the location and went there and it turned out it was one of his ex-girlfriend's houses. I confronted him about it and he's like, oh, I was just picking up a few things. I do question him, but whenever I do, he seems to get like really mad about it. He gets loud and sometimes kind of like violent with his choice of words. Uh, very sneaky to trace his Google Maps. I never thought about that. I got a new thing that's delete. Wait till you get a girlfriend that checks your car mileage. <laughs> <laughs> Coincidentally, one of the girls, Catherine, is actually a twin. They are the Swallow Twins. I thought it was a nickname, and then I found out that's actually their last name. So instead of one blonde girl, we're having two young blonde girls hitting on them. Interesting. So I hope that doesn't help it too much, but <laughs> these are them. We're gonna have them hit on your boyfriend as he's coming out of the gym. How do you think he did? You didn't have to get two girls. They were both willing to work for the same rate, so I figured why not? Two is better than one. He got the buy one, get one free special. <laughs> yeah, but the thing is if he passes this, then woof, you gotta keep her, right? I guess so, yeah, you're right. All right, uh, I'm gonna play the footage for you. Is, is Louis single? Uh, do you know I don't know, but I am. Okay, <laughs> there's two of us. Hey. Did you work out? <laughs> yeah. We actually wanted to talk to you. Uh, we've been looking for a gym around to get so fit. Are you guys looking for a personal trainer? Are you a trainer? Uh, yeah. Do you live around here? Or? Yeah, it's just, like across the streets, but yeah, right there. we're actually in town. For the weekend. For the weekend. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we're, we're looking, looking for people to hang out with and you see We could work. go work out together. Yeah. You could help us work out. Is this like a porn thing? God, no. What? It's kind of... No, 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 no. We get that all the time. Yeah, we're twins. Night. Of course, we're identical twins. Which one? Oh, Catherine. Swallow. Nice to meet you. We're the... Swallow. We're more of a the hugger. Swallow? <laughs> yeah, swallow. Yeah, yeah, that's our last name. Is this for real? Like, no, 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 it is. I know. And we're the to become a nickname, too. But yeah. It's our last name. I mean, we always say live up to your name, you know? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I was a dance player in college. Oh, really? Yeah. That's your dad. Yeah. Let's see yeah. those moves. Yeah. Oh, so, sure. Sure. Totally. Here's the. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, awesome. Which twin would you rather hang out with? Okay, I have bigger tits. Okay. I have nicer abs. Punch them up. Oh. Wow. Yeah. Okay, but yeah. not to the tits. Okay. No, but the abs. We <laughs> just all hang out and, like, you know. Are you free? Any plans this weekend? Uh, I uh, should be free. Also, can you get out yeah. at an Airbnb or something? Like, yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool. cool. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, to be completely clear with you, we just have been wanting to have a I hope that doesn't sound I'm getting weird. engaged. Look, I'm engaged. Uh, I'm getting She's married. She's getting boring. I just want to do something. Do you know anyone? I mean, honestly, you're so sexy. We don't do this every day. Okay, we're on the hidden cameras. No, no, like, this is no, 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 no. We are completely <laughs> serious. Like, you're going to be one lucky guy this weekend. I think it could be one. Do you want to do it? This is serious. Come on, let's do it. I promise. Do you want to? We've been talking well, about this and then we saw mean, you. Yeah. Uh, what? yeah, okay. Hey, so do you want to do that for really? us? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Oh my god. Can we? Alright. Yeah. Uh, you don't, I'm sorry, you're single, obviously. Yeah. Uh, sorry, I ask, forgot to ask probably the first question. We should have asked, yeah. Yeah. Um, Hopefully. Yeah, I'm single. Yeah, you broke up? Yeah. Uh, no, my girlfriend passed away six months ago. It's been, uh, it was kind of rough. She had cancer, and then like, her mom's been real supportive. She told me I should move on. Are you sure it's too soon? Is it too soon? No, it's like it's time to like get out and just like meet people. Like, okay. This is doesn't make fun. Hang out, yeah. talk about yeah. but then get down there. All right, well, let's go, right? Let's uh. Let's, I love uh, that spirit. Uh, no, but but you mean like meet like later? We can't right now. I mean, we're visiting. We're seeing our aunt. We 
already like have we just like, like have plans, plans with her. Um, but you have no, her later, number. Later, you have her number. We're dead serious. I mean, we're serious. Like we want to do this. Do you think we would randomly approach a random person and ask a random her extremely hot person? Yeah. But I just so mentioned. We would never do this. No, but uh, yeah, I'll text you guys and you know we'll see what happens. Okay, great. Yeah, I'm so can we? Wow. I'm so sorry that you had to hear that. That was honestly not at all what I was expecting. This is, I watched this right now for the first time with you. Well, I'm not dead, that's for sure. He, no, hell no, you're a survivor. If he's no, maybe I wish I had died. God. No, don't say that. Don't say that. This guy is just an asshole. He's not even a physical trainer. Look, it seems like this guy just literally lies about anything and everything. Like, he'll say anything to get laid. I know we talked about it before, but I think the next step is to confront him. I mean, do you want to stay with him after hearing this? A part of me, maybe. The other part of me is just, he's just nothing but a scum. Piece of shit. A part of you still wants to stay with him? Is it? My question is, is he actually going to meet with these girls or? I mean, it seemed pretty evident. Like, I would just say this beyond if he's just a cheater. Like, I really do think this guy's just a to, to even use cancer as like a freaking ploy to like get laid. Like that's just an ugly person, you know? I think you deserve way better than that, Debbie. Mm -hmm. But I mean, ultimately this is up to you. I really shouldn't even voice my opinion. But the next step like we talked about would be to confront him. I know you guys have a history together, but this is the guy you're dating right here. Yeah. Do you want to break up with him? Or do you want to stay with him? I just don't know if I can do better. Now, Debbie, trust me, you can do a hundred times better than this. I like it. It kind of hurts me to hear you even say that. We had our Swallow Twins continue to text Deborah's boyfriend and set up a date for this Thursday at 3 p.m. to engage in their threesome. When are you free to meet up? We're leaving soon. I can do this Thursday. I get out of work early. They follow up by sending this sexy pic from their Instagram. It's Thursday, almost 3 p.m., and we've been preparing all morning to set up this small boyfriend. Yeah, just show us what you guys have, yeah. what you guys brought, and we can... This is Sam's favorite department. <laughs> I bet it is. Do so you want the matching some... colors, Sam? Uh, let me see what they have. I brought some, and they actually match pretty nicely, so... Yeah, like two Just show us your favorite outfit, I guess. Okay. Huh? How are you feeling? Nervous. Yeah. Yeah. Everyone's. He just texted me. He's 30 minutes away. Okay. That's good. I'll be as soon as I can. Nervous. Ready. Four. No. What? Can you cut the camera? Why? What's wrong? You just want to talk a little bit. Uh, sure. So cut. Yeah. I think you made her nervous. <laughs> Okay. Maybe if we hadn't set this whole thing up, he wouldn't have. True. Um, I mean, it's up to you. We'll do whatever you want to do. He did agree to come over here. Maybe I should call him first. It might help me feel a little better. Maybe I can even try and talk him out of it. I, I don't know. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, do you want to call him right now? Yeah. And if he doesn't come through, then you know you got what you need. Yeah, good, good. Everything all right, guys? Yeah. Yeah. Did you just uh, call him really quick? And she's just gonna basically, call him. yeah, she's, she's, gonna gonna get call a, him or? she's gonna get a word with him and just kind of see where he's at. And are they gonna be involved or? No, well, of course not. Oh, okay. Huh. Sorry, girls. Cool. <laughs> if you guys want, you just have to see over here. Yeah. So you're gonna call him? Yeah, I'm gonna call him. Hey, babe. Um, What's up? I just got off the phone with um, the doctor. Just called. Um, they they want me to come in at two thirty. I was hoping you would come with me. Two thirty today. Yes, they they found something. I know we thought everything was going good, but I could. <sighs> that sucks. I could really use your support right now. Um, you know, I'm tired of work right now. Uh, can I meet you there later? You know, you'd be stuck there waiting for a while. This is important. I, I could really use your support. I uh, I would love to support you. I just like I don't lose my job. Um, but as soon as I get off, I'll, I'll come over. Like. As, as soon as I can. All right. I guess I'll see you then. Okay. Good luck. Thanks. <laughs> Listen. Regardless of whether this guy's a cheater or not, like he's he is a. Mm -hmm. Like you shouldn't be dating this guy. He's trash, honestly. Yeah. I'm so sorry, man. Yeah. Do not feel bad about that at all. All right. Here. Hold on. Hold on. Well, I mean, if you girls need still someone to test, I'm available. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try to imitate their voices here. <clears throat>
When are you free to meet up? We're leaving town soon. <laughs> what the f are you doing, Luis? It helps me get in character.